Hi you guys, welcome back to Your Sugar Cookie. Thank you for tuning in. Today I'm gonna to share with you a Black Friday beauty haul. Most of the things I picked up either last night, Thanksgiving um, evening, or um, today, but I really worked all day because I work in retail, um, are all beauty products. I did get some clothes, but I'm not gonna share that with you guys unless you guys are interested in clothing hauls. If so, just leave a comment below and like this video and I'll start including some of the clothes that I purchased or wear because I I buy a lot of clothes. I'm a little fashionista. But I'm going to get started. I went to MAC and of course MAC never has a sale and never is at IMAX or anything like that but I did pick up two items that I wanted. I have a wanted list for MAC. And I just knock off some of the things that I continue to buy along the way. And the first thing is um, a lip liner called Night Moth, which is a dark, dark um, color. And this is what it looks like. And it's also on my lips right now. Um, not filling in my whole lips, but I have it as a lip liner on my lips right now. And I also picked up a highlighter pen that I have been wanting for a while now. And because I'm just now getting into the highlighting and contouring, and I picked up the highlighter pen in Bright Forecast. And it has an applicator like this, a brush applicator, and it's like that. So, yeah, I'm going to start um, highlighting with this. I usually highlight with a concealer, but not like, oh my God, so bright. Like two shades to one shade lighter than my skin tone. I highlighted today. I don't know if you can tell. It's dark um, in my room, and I have a little light, so the lightning is kind of off. The next place I went to is Victoria's Secret. And Victoria's Secret, I had a coupon for, you know how you usually get like a free panty or something. This time I got a free spray and I got the fragrance Aqua Kiss. I love this fragrance. And I use body spray to like when I take a shower at night or anything and I just want to spray my body um, before I get in the bed or anything like that or... You know, I don't know. I don't use really use it as perfume because I have perfume and I'm using perfume as its purpose. But I use the body spray before I, I put on clothes if that makes any sense. Like when I put on my panties and my bra, I just spray myself, then put my clothes on, then put my perfume on in that order. <laughs> the next place is Ulta is where I went. And from Ulta, I got a couple of things. I got this, um, you know, also sells a couple of body shop products. And I have um, the Tea Tree Skin Clearing Toner. I usually use Witch Hazel, but I watch um, Vicky Lou, and she uses this, and her skin is like flawless. And I really like this. So, and I have been using it for the past couple of nights when I take off my makeup. I um, use actually this cleanser now I have the little bottle of this because I want to try it out and it's the tea tree as well and it's like a peppermint um, tingly sensation it feels really good on my skin I feel like I'm getting all the dirt and access out of my pores and um, cleaning my skin at the end of the night and so far I have been loving this combination so I will be buying the big bottle of the cleanser the next thing I got from um, Ulta is this NYX Matte Finish Spray. And I have many um, finishing sprays. Well, not really a lot, but I have the Urban Decay Oil Control Finishing Spray. And I have the Fix Plus, which is really not a finishing spray, but it's like to give you a, a fresh mist on your face. And I really like both of them, but I want to, um, I have oily skin, so I want to see how well does this work when I put on, like, uh, my CoverGirl 3-in-1. Sometimes when I wear for a long time, like throughout the day, I get a little oily in my T-zone, so I want to spray myself with that and see if it will last a little longer. I also bought the Urban Decay um, All Nighter 
um, long lasting finishing sprays. As you can see, I like for my makeup to really last. So I just got the um, mini size of this one because I'm going to um, start traveling in July, uh, June. Not June. Oh my God. In January, start off the new year, right? I will be at IMAX in January, which is an international makeup trade show. So, in the comment below, let me know if you'll be there. It would be great if we can meet each other in person. My nose ring was coming out. Also, as you know, I use the MAC um, eyebrow pencil in Spike. And I heard really good things about Anastasia um, Brow Wiz. So, I got the eyebrow pencil in the color Brunette. I have used it once. So far, I really like it. And with my spike pencil, it's retractable, which is this is retractable as well. But it like breaks off every now and then. And that pisses me off because that pencil costs $15, even though this one costs even more. But it doesn't hurt to try. And if you're a beauty guru and YouTube guru, you like to try different things that YouTubers um, have on their channel. And I'm so far liking this pencil a lot and it has a spoolie on the other end of the pencil as well. I also bought a big pencil sharpener with the big holes and the little holes because those NYX jumbo pencils and I have big um, like liners and I didn't have a pencil sharpener for it so I have a small and a big one. I also bought a eyeshadow base from NYX. And this is just the white one. I want the nude one as well because I have the jumbo pencil in that one. But sometimes, and I'm trying to get a kit together for my um, being a makeup freelance artist. So, I need things like that that's very sanitary. And the jumbo stick I'm using on myself so I can just, you know, put it on. I also have NYX eyeshadow uh, and Dance the Tides. And it's just a brown shade. Um, I don't know if you can see it. It's like a reddish brown. It kind of reminds me of, is it Brown Script or um, Embarked by MAC? I also have been freaking in love with these NYX Butter Glosses. So I just got the little pack of NYX Butter Glosses. And I have, in this pack, it is Eclair, oh gosh, oh Eclair, no, Creme Brulee, Apple Strudel, and I don't know how to pronounce that one. It starts with an M. I have creme brulee already, so I'm just going to give that up, my extra one, to my little sister or put it in my kit. The next thing I have is NYX Shine Killer Primer. I'm all about priming and making sure my makeup stays all day. The next thing, the last thing I got from NYX is Vava Violet from Revlon. And it's on my lips right now. And actually, it is a dupe for Cyber that is at is by MAC. And this is the color right here. It's like a very, very dark violet. I freaking love it. Um, today, I had to wear all black at work today for Black Friday. And I had gotten so many compliments on my outfit. The next thing, um, next place is Walmart. And what I got from Walmart is a lot of e.l.f. products. Um, because e.l.f. is just the bomb.com and instead of going on their site, because you know they have a lot of things on their site, many uh, Walmarts and Targets are selling a lot of things from e.l.f. now and so I finally found the stifling brush um, from e.l.f. I've been hearing very, uh, a lot of reviews on it that it's wonderful, it's kind of like the MAC one, blah blah blah, so I'm going to put it to the test. So I picked up two of those stippling brushes. You can never have enough brushes, ladies. The next one I got is a small angled brush by e.l.f. I also got um, the mascara and shadow shield. You know, from when you're um, trying to do your bottom lashes and you don't want to get any mascara on the bottom. Yes. This is going to be love. I need to get more of those. I also got a um, baked blush. Look at that. Oh my God. That looks beautiful. I would swatch it, but I don't want to make this video so long. And I also got a blush called Pink Passion by e.l.f. It's very pink, and I feel like that would really show up on my skin tone. 
And I also got a baked eyeshadow, but I might use this as a blush because I like the way it looks. But it looks like that. I don't know if you can see it. I also got the Makeup Lock and Seal, which is like, not glue, but you know how you put loose pigment or loose glitter pigment on your eyes? That's what you can use to make it stick. I also, you know, I collect nail polishes. Every time I get my nails done, I bring my nail polish to the salon. And I picked up an Etsy color, and it is called Carry On. I'm into my burgundies for the winter and the fall. So I might wear that um, during my birthday month, which is December. My birthday is December 13th. Yes, I'm a Sagittarius. The last place I went to is Target. And I picked up some more wipes. You guys know these are my go-to makeup wipes to take my makeup off. I picked up, uh, it was a pack of these little Clinics. You can never not have enough Clinics, especially in your purse. Thumbs up if you want me to do what's in my purse video. I was thinking about doing it um, later on this evening or this week. Um, I also got two Rimmel pencils. I used this one today. But this is the black one and this is the new one. And the black one is really good. It doesn't smudge. It's on my waterline now. It ha it's been really, really black all day. Another thing I got, and i um seen this on Beauty Essentials channel. She had it on her lips, and I'm like, oh, my God. I really like that. And this is the Revlon um, Matte Balm. And look how pigmented that is. It's a purple. And it looks very nice on the lips. I also got this from her channel. See, I need to stop watching YouTube at night because I like to just look at it and end up buying the stuff the next day. But she also had this on her channel. And this is like, um, this is a blush. And it is very nice. I um, swatched it on my hand and I really like it. It's going to really come in handy for the summer and springtime and i also picked up another revlon lipstick it's called um coral berry and it's just a like i don't know orange champagne color this is the color right here so you guys that is all of my beauty haul that i got it was kind of a lot of stuff but not really but if you would like um, to see more hauls from me, please thumbs up this video. Tell your friend about my channel. Subscribe today. And all the products that I have uh, purchased will be in the description bar below in case you're interested in it. And I hope to see you later. I hope you had a great holiday and didn't eat too much. Bye. Mwah. Oh, wait. <laughs> Okay, so I still have my 18, two 18-inch 18 bundles in my hair. I wanded it yesterday for Thanksgiving, my whole head. And you see how these curls are just still in and bouncy? So, yeah, just wanted to throw that in. Okay, bye. Mwah.